Hello everyone and welcome to the final part of this tutorial series. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at data saving so that we can save our uh, owned characters. So when, the, so when the player leaves the game and rejoins, he'll still have his characters saved. Also, if you guys want to talk to other scripters or developers in Roblox uh, or have any problem with your uh, uh, script, make sure to join my Discord server. The link will be in the description. Before this video starts, if you guys want to support me and want to have access to all of my project files, including the one you're watching right now, they will all be available in my Patreon in the $10 tier. With that being said, let's start. Okay, so to start off with, what we're going to do is enter our character shop and it's called main script in service script service, and we're going to get uh, some services. So local data store service, data store service, is equal to game come on get service data store service and then we'll create a data store so local data store data store is equal to and uh data store service come on get data store and we'll just put in uh our data key so for me it's going to be my data store keep in mind that whenever you change this your data will be reset so uh, what I also forgot to do is get uh, players service. So local players is equal to game. Go on get service players, and then what I'm going to do is go down here and create a function for player removing. So local function player removing, and that will take the player and. Then what I'm going to do is to just uh, create a table. So local uh, characters or local underscore characters is equal to and an empty table. And what I'm going to do inside of this function is uh, loop through all of the characters that the player owns when they leave the game and uh, add them to this table. Add, just add the names to this table, the names of the characters. And then we'll, uh, we'll save the table. So to do that, we have to wrap everything in a P call so that if it errors, it's not going to break the entire script. So local success, comma, error is equal to P call function. And what we're gonna do is loop through the player's own characters. So for I comma V in pairs, player dot characters dot, uh, dot character shop dot owned characters call get children do and table dot insert characters uh characters comma uh, i mean underscore characters comma v dot name make sure that you only insert the name not the actual object and then what i'm going to do is uh do uh data store on set async and player dot user id dot dot and uh, characters characters comma and uh, uh, characters or underscore characters and down here what i'm going to do is check if success so if this was successful then we're going to print success and else uh one so one error and then what i'm going to do is go down here and do game combine to close function and we're going to we will loop through all of the players so for icon v in pairs players colon gets players do and if uh actually uh, player moving and uh, v dot name or v and then we'll just put a wait one second and then what i'm going to do is fix some stuff here in the by dot on server invoke function so uh, in here change this to player dot character shop dot equipped character dot value 
and just do this for all of these so just do that here and that should be it and then we'll get the data from here so local uh underscore characters is equal uh, to nil and local success comma error is equal to pcol function and uh, what, we'll, what we'll do is underscore characters is equal to and uh, data store call get async this time not set async so down here we set async and we save the data and here we will load the data so data store call and get async and again player dot user id dot dot and uh, characters make sure that you spell this the, th it's the same way that you spelled it down here and don't put a comma underscore characters this time just uh, player dot user id dot dot characters and down here if success and underscore characters is not equal to nil then else print uh actually else one error so error and in here i'm going to loop through the characters so for icon of the in pairs uh underscore characters do and uh, local new val is equal to instance dot new and we will create a string value and new val dot name is equal to and uh, v not v dot name and new val dot parent is equal to owned characters and now if i play the game that should actually work actually before i play the game what i forgot to mention is make sure that you go to home uh, game settings monitor i mean security and make sure that enable studio access to api services is checked and just save that and then you can play the game actually what i forgot to do is in here i'm going to do players dot player removing colon connect player removing now that should work so if I just go back to my players characters as you can see it saved my uh, owned characters and that is because I was trying this earlier so I'm just going to change my data store key to maybe my data store 11 and that should hopefully work so players uh characters as you can see i don't have any characters right now but if i buy a tanker and as you can see now i have this character and our equipped character value is still set to nil but we don't need that and uh we have a value for tanker here and if i just buy Russo talks now we have that value and if i just go ahead and leave the game as you can see did not print success and that is because um owned characters is not a valid member of player dot players prog okay that is very simple to fix i forgot to change this to characters not owned characters so make sure you do that and then play the game and that should work this time so um character shop i don't have any characters if i just buy this this and leave the game as you can see this time it's printed success and if i join the game now it should save my characters and as you can see i have my characters saved and i can just equip them from the shop so character shop uh, mr frank slam buy and as you can see i have him equipped actually let's check out if we have okay so we still own russo talks and we still own tanker so that works and i think this is going to be it for today's tutorial if this helps make sure to subscribe turn on the notifications bell and uh, share the video with your friends and i'll see you all in the next video bye